This is not the game you're looking for. You can move about your business. The voice of honest trailers. Hello. Roll out. All right. Oh! Imitation gaming. Back in the day of LucasArts, they made some really crappy games. This is Liam Neeson, and we're going to play The Phantom Menace. My body is ready. <laughs> a particular set of skills and I'm going to use them to play this game. A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away, George Lucas decided to make prequels to the most awesomest movie he's ever made. It wasn't the greatest idea he ever had. A bad this game is proof this. that you can't just throw a lightsaber and the word Star Wars in a game and make it awesome. Well. I have a bad feeling about this entire game. Don't let them clash your judgment. Plan, Qui I have a feeling that's the not quite our Jin. That's that king guy the from well, they Dragonheart. It looks like a worse version of Tomb Raider to me. Wow, this control scheme is really horrible. I've found a bluster that you can't pick up unless you step directly on top of it. Oh no, it's a terrible picture of Queen Amadaba. Back when they used gifts for their screens. Get out of the way. Kong Kong. Ah, it's a thermal detonator. I want you to take the thermal detonator to the top of the building. Throw it. I will hear you. I want you to pull the pin out of the grenade. Count the three so I can hear it. And this, and this perspective is one of the worst things ever. Door is open. Let's go. I can't get in there. Open the ding door. Ah, darn it. We're outnumbered. Follow me. They've locked us in. Ooh, look at those amazing graphics. And I can't see squat down here. Or oh, shoot. The thing has the same powers as Emperor Palpatine. You have paid the price for your lack of vision. Ah, oh, crapola. Ow. Stop shocking me, you jerk. Seems like it's such a logical thing to put all these mazes here. One of these doors might have opened. Perhaps it's this one. Oh, crap. I was not prepared for the door. This is the door I'm looking for. Ouch. Oh! It just cut me into tiny little pieces. Oh, that be that was painful. <laughs> well, that took long enough. This perspective. Leaves so much to be desired. From a certain point of view. Ah, uh, another dead end. It would really help if there was some kind of map, but there isn't. Do you see a map? No. And you can't open that door. That's where we came in. Maybe I can force push these things. Nope. Ah, don't hurt me. I killed you anyway. Yes. Whatever it was, I just did it. I think I just... Oh no. Oh shoot. I can't take those guys on. Give me all of your powers. I've got... Ah, oh, I found myself again. I will find you. Wow, these cutscenes are even slower than some of the old, old, old games. I'm almost out of here. As long as Jar Jar Binks doesn't show up, we'll be all right. I have no idea what I'm doing. There we go. No problem. I think I finally made it. Nope, more mazes. This game is amazing. That's a pun. I've got to get out of here. Ah, and I died. <laughs> That's it. I'm not playing this game anymore. It sucks balls. Great big sets of balls. I do have some money, but what I don't have is a particular set of gaming skills. If you like this video, share it and click subscribe. Click here for more imitation gaming videos. Click here for more epic voice reviews.